If you're considering dental implants or have been looking into them, you've probably heard of a treatment called bone grafting implants. Just as the foundation is important when constructing a building, it's important to have a solid foundation to increase the success rate of your implants. One of the most important factors in increasing the success rate of dental implants is strong bone, and bone grafting is a treatment for weak gum bone. Today, we're going to answer some of the questions you may have about bone grafting, including what it is and when it should be done. What is bone grafting? In order to place dental implants, you need to have enough gum bone to accommodate them. If an implant is placed when the gum bone is weak, it may not be able to integrate well into the bone, limiting its ability to stay firmly in place. If you don't have enough bone, you can have a dental implant placed with graft material to create new bone, which is called a bone graft with implant treatment. Bone grafting implants, why should I do it? For example, if you go camping, you will inevitably have to pitch a tent, and you will drive pegs into the ground to keep the tent from swaying or collapsing due to wind or external impact. The ground needs to be sufficient and firm in order to anchor the tent more firmly and securely. You can think of it the same way with bone graft implants. If it is determined that there is insufficient bone, bone grafting is used to ensure that the implant is firmly anchored and securely bonded. This ensures a strong osseointegration, which allows for high anchorage and chewing strength to be restored. In what situations are bone graft implants used? Bone grafting implants are performed in the following situations. If your gum bone is too thin or low in height, you have lost gum bone due to neglect over a long period of time after tooth loss. Trauma has caused damage and fractures in the gum bone. When the gum bone is in poor condition due to severe periodontal disease, are bone grafting implants mandatory? Bone grafting implants are not always a good idea or a requirement to proceed with dental implants. Your individual condition will determine whether or not you should have bone grafting, so it's best to discuss your options with your surgeon. Today, we've covered bone grafting. We hope this helps to answer some of your questions about bone grafting.